across. Uh, right now, it's just Ben, Randall, and I in Street Mod. There are actually two other people here today, uh, but they're not the regulars. So Ben, his car is currently being built. His Subaru, which made you know around 400 horsepower, is getting everything built up. He spent a shitload of money, and uh, it's gonna be impressive. So here today, his car is still not done. It uh, he's driving one of our pro drivers' car, Christian. Still an STI, it's an older STI, but the car is quick. So in Randall, Randall's car is a supercharged FRS. So that car is quick. And keep in mind, I'm on slick, so I have to be 2% uh, faster than them. So if they get a 36 and I get a 35.5, it's not good enough. I gotta beat them by you know a little bit more than that. in the garage for some quick post-race analysis you can see the uh, the times here for overall it uh, I did beat everyone in street modified raw time for the daylight runs although with the modifier I was talking about I didn't beat them by enough oh well uh, and the daylight was actually I think I had like a top four time but at night did not do as good at night I was almost two and a half seconds slower at night and as you saw you know the, uh, my lights aren't very good, um, did have the confidence, I think, and didn't have enough runs to really get in and build up my time and speed as, like, we did last year where we just did all six at night, so, 
We'll have to see uh, next year, maybe add some more lighting or something so I can see a little bit further out. Because, like, especially when you do the turnaround, you're looking left like you normally do, you can't see anything. So you just kind of have to know. And you look at the run, and I took the turnaround way too wide, and that's why I lost a lot of time. So as far as Ben and Randall, Randall kicked butt once again. Uh, especially with the modifier, he even beat my daylight time at night. So it's become apparent that I'm going to need some upgrades to the Mustang. We'll talk about that in a second. And Ben, Ben got about the same time in the daylight time as Randall and the rest of the crew in his borrowed STI, which is very, very well set up. The, the person who was borrowing it from got the first and second best time of the day. So that car is top notch. But as far as nighttime for Ben and Randall, uh, Ben coned away all of his nighttime runs, unfortunately. So that really hurt his uh, combined score. And Randall actually got the Night Rider Award because he improved his uh, his daylight to night time. So as far as the Mustang going forward, uh, so when you lose, and when you ain't first, you last. And in my case, I'm yeah, you know, I'm still getting top ten, which is pretty good from where I've been at. I've been doing this a few years now. Don't consider myself a pro or anything, but uh, I consider myself fairly intermediate. Um, you get two options when you're losing. You keep practicing. Spend money. So in this case, I'm going to do both. I'm going to start doing more events and be moving to the St. Florida region. So I'm going to start doing more events and upgrade to coilovers. So if you liked the video, make sure to hit subscribe below, hit like, uh, share it with your friends. If you didn't, comment below, tell me what we can do to improve it. And thanks again for watching.